y'all realize that it's not possible at any given time to know how many people are on the planet. That's not even possible. There's no mechanism, there's no science, there's no uh, God count, there's no there's no way of knowing how many people are on the earth. Anytime that you hear somebody say, oh, there's this many people on the earth, there's a billion and there's three billion people on the earth. They just throwing a number out there. They just guesstimating and throwing a number out there. It is not possible to know what's going on on all, all of the entire planet, especially for one person or one group of people, one civilization, or one uh, 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 kingdom or whatever we want to call it, one village. It's not possible for that those people to know everything that's going on in the world. Everybody that's on the world, every village, every villager, that's not even possible. All of that falls under the God concept, which I call the God, the God concept. That's where you give these humans a God-like intelligence, as if people ha- can, uh, excuse me, as if people can actually uh, give you a number of how many people are on the earth. Why am I talking about how many people are on the earth? Why is that important? Why do I care? Why should anybody care if we don't know how many people are on the planet? I'm saying this to say, all the talk that you hear about where black people came from in this country, we migrated from Africa, we came from here, we came, you know, we all came from Africa, we came in slavery, da 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 If you believe that theory, you would have to believe that uh, humans some four or five hundred years ago had a way to know exactly what was going on on the entire planet. That's what you're saying when you say, you know, when you believe those stories that they tell them, when you believe that all black people came from Africa, you're basically saying that you, you literally believe that these people knew everything that was going on in the entire planet. Now, with that not even being possible today, and we have all these satellites, air tags, GPS this, GPS that, everybody down there, everybody got a phone, even with all of that, we still don't have no, it's still not a possible way to know how many people on the planet at any given time? Where they all are, is that the Why is this important? Because I don't believe the all people came from two people, all people came from Africa theory. I think that's a biblical, you would have to believe, if you believe that, you believe in the Bible. Because that's what the Bible says, that's where you got it from. You didn't get that from no, nothing else. You got that from the Bible and the pe- other people that where they got that from is the Bible. So you would have to have faith in man. You don't have faith in God. You have faith in man. That man, t- all this shit man told you about God and the earth and all that. You believe in man so much that you believe that he told that he has a God concept. You know, he's close to God. Man is close to God. Or, or you know what y'all perceive as God. And that means everything that they say is right, is exact and true. Like how many people are on the planet? How many people were on the planet when Columbus landed in America? How many people uh, came from Africa? How many people didn't come from Africa? A lot of this stuff, we will never know because at any given time, there could be anybody on the planet. Back when Columbus came to America, and he say he discovered the Indians. Okay, what, okay. let's say he did discover some Indians. Does that mean that there wasn't other villages of black people on the planet or on, in the Americas? How would, how would they have known? How would they have known? These dudes riding horses and shit. They came over here on sailboats. They didn't even have motors. How would they know all everything that's going on in America? They would have to ride a stagecoach with a horse pulling it to even venture out and, and you know, Explorer, they would have to use a stagecoach. 
You see what I'm saying? It would take it would take them months. When people traveled way back in the day, it would take them months just to get you know to one from one city to the next. It would take them months to do so. So with that type of movement, that type of uh, uh, um, technology, how in the fuck would people know everything that's going on on the planet? Every all the people that were there. Some people you could be. I could be right here in Texas. I am in Texas. I, I'm in Texas. Does that mean since I'm in Texas, I know everything that's going on in Texas? Does that mean I know about all the people everywhere they stay? You know, if they're black, white, this, that, the third. I know all of that because I landed in Texas. So, just, so because I landed in Texas, I should know everything that's going on in Texas. That's y'all. That's the that's that's the out of Africa theory. Is the is I'm gonna believe these people um, because because just because they said it. <laughs> I'm gonna believe this because it was written. It was written in a some person wrote it wrote in a book. And on that note, I'm gonna run with it. But I don't believe none of this shit. And then another thing is humans ain't shit. Think about all the people that you know. Think about how much they lie. How much they connive, how much they make up shit. Humans lie a lot. So why would I believe a human from way, especially back in the day? Because anything they couldn't figure out, they would just say God did it. Or they would say a witch did it. You know what I'm saying? So why would I, why in the fuck would I think that they would know everything that's going on on the planet? Everything that's going on on the continent? How would they know? It's not even possible. It's not possible whatsoever for me or anyone else in, on this planet to know how many people are on the planet. What are they doing right now? You know, it, the planet is too vast. You got to think. There's places on the planet that we haven't even been. We haven't even just, like, explored those places. There's places in the ocean where we haven't even been. So how can we sit here and say, Oh, you know, all people came from here. That's that's one story coming from one group of people. And even if you had that story coming from multiple groups of people, it's th- there still was a billion other people that could have had a, a totally different story. You see what I'm saying? There's there's uh, there's African American descendants out here in this land somewhere who their grandparents or great grandparents actually had a a different story than the Columbus thing. But you'll never hear that story because they just weren't popular like that. The Columbus thing was popular. The Jesus thing is popular. That's why you know about it. You see what I'm saying? But in all truth and actuality, this, what I'm saying right now, just totally debunks the outer Africa, the all of that, because it's just not possible to know. It's not possible to know. All that all the stuff y'all talking about, they say, well, source up. If you source up, you just reading what another human wrote. There's not one human who knows how the planet began or where people came from. So if you if you're reading what a human wrote, you could be reading a falsehood. You could be reading some bullshit and don't even know it. More than likely you are reading some bullshit. Because black people don't know, and not just black people, people period don't know everybody that's on the earth and what they got going on. It's just not possible. It's never been possible. It may, maybe in the future it might be, maybe possible or something. I don't know. They'll come out with something or something. But as of everything stands now, going from here and back to 2,000 years ago or whatever, there's never been a time on this planet where you could take a group of people and that group of people would know everything that's going on on the planet. Debunked facts. It's somebody media. I'm out. And what's your plan, house nigga? I bet you don't even want to escape. All on mass and nuts. Killer, killer, listen, I got a little missing. Ain't nobody tripping if Zimmerman missing. Then what? We cut them in pieces, we feed them the fishes. Them bitches want water, we grant them they wishes. Thanks.